a hot mess. I met a few of y'all at the airport. Y'all were lovely and wonderful. My luggage is lost. Yes, they lost my luggage. The doll does not have her garments, but her best garments, her best garments are in her carry-on because I'm not playing with y'all. But in the meantime, in between time, we're here, we're in a car. Mr. B, Kenny. Oh no, I look a hot mess, please. Oh, I look a hot mess, hello. Wait a minute, what, my luggage came? I can't see me. <laughs> I'm working out. It's like I have. I don't have on bottoms, people. Uh -huh. My luggage came. <laughs> I, it's so funny because I just asked Grace. I was like, "Did you get any word on my luggage?" She was like, "No." The luggage that came went to. I think she said Monrovia, mm -hmm. um, which is I think is Liberia, right? <laughs> and look at Kenny. Look at Kenny being cow. They just down there watching shows. Ew, don't, don't put this on. Cal, this is what the people want to see. The real deal. Tanika B. Well, let them know that this eating sneakers is yours, not mine. The what? The Snickers. The they Kennedy. can't see. They can't see the detail. Oh, they just oh, really, oh. they just really see Kennedy, lady of leisure. <laughs> A lady of leisure. My luggage came. My luggage came. Wow, I'm so grateful. I reached out to, oh, let me turn this off. Oh my God, where's the luggage? Waiting on the luggage. I'm like, is this, oh my God. Da, 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 da. Priority transfer. Hmm. And didn't transfer. <laughs> Kennedy's tail far back that she got for Christmas and um, her bed which I don't want to really show her sleeping because I feel like that's shady you can see her arm but there's a big like full size I think it's a queen bed and then up the steps is our little loft area air conditioning throughout we have this little like couch area and then we have all my clothes are out those are mr. B's things I just got my bag back this is the bathroom just like the master bathroom and this is the bed I just put my luggage there but and yeah, so that is the space. Mr. B's hiding behind the door because he doesn't want me to us to see him. This is the space. I really like it. I think it's totally worth it. Okay, so <clears throat> I showed you our. I don't know why my skin looks so crazy. <laughs> I showed you our our room. Now I want to show you my my outfit. Um, this top is from Mara Hoffman. These nails are from the Claw Collective, black owned brand. 
female ethically sourced brand, Mara Hoffman Love. This necklace is from Omalola. Love um, her jewelry. It's a tiny African pendant. These nails are also from that brand. These pants, another black owned brand, female. I don't know how far back. <laughs> I have to go for you to see my pants, but I love these pants. They're wide leg pants, but they have a drawstring at the bottom. So um, they're kind of like MC Hammer pants. I get to like tie the pants, which I can appreciate because, um, you know, it's very like sandy here and dusty. And so I don't want the bottom of my pants to get dirty. And I only brought like four or five pair of pants. So these are basically all the pants that I have. Also wearing my Chanel slides some flats today and so we are just going to um, eat at the African Regent buffet which we've eaten there before for Christmas so so excited it's Christmas Day eating at the African Regent and then we're going to go to um, the Kapinski to pick up our stuff our Afrochella wristbands and then we're gonna come back probably like take some Christmas pictures and then um, I think that's pretty much it. I think so. Um, and then I'm gonna check in for my sister because she's staying here too, but it's under my name. And then we're gonna go get her from the airport because she and my niece fly in to Ghana today. Ghana, Ghana, Ghana. <laughs> sitting in the lobby at the African Region Hotel. Um, we're about to have brunch. It's Christmas Day, so we're about to have brunch. And I love their brunch. They do have a Sunday brunch every Sunday regardless. Today is Saturday, but they're known for their like Christmas Day brunch. They have like Christmas Day music. They're actually setting up right now. That's just talking. <laughs> they're actually setting up. So let's go in for brunch. Y'all to witness this hater, <laughs> Mr. B the hater. Oh, I didn't get none of those messages. I'm looking at your phone and your phone. And the second hater the laughing at daddy's jokes about me. The first message arrived three hours and 47 minutes ago. On my way here. You hear the music. Huh? On ACB? Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're leaving the African Regent Hotel. Um, we need to go find our driver. Uh, the food was good. It is always very good. Where? Um, oh, you think that's him? Okay, we're going to find our driver.
never mind the loud um, Celine Dion, you know, the people love Celine Dion. I am the people, so. Um, I'm looking for some products for Kennedy for her here. Like, she has, um, she needs like some sulfur eight and she forgot it at home, so I wanna get some. That's the beauty of being in, on the African continent. Okay, you just walk into any grocery store, any grocery store, and you can find, you know, you walk into any grocery store and you can find Shea Moisture. Okay, so we are back at our Airbnb, which is Embassy Gardens. Um, I actually think we booked um, the Cantonments location. I actually know we did, but we're staying at the um, we're staying at the Embassy Gardens one because we can't. That's where the address brings you. So we are here, and it is um, the address like the GPS brings you to this location. But it's like that's like the main office. So, um, we went to Kapinski today to go to the Afri-Style Lounge, which has a bunch of like African designers. Most of the designers are Ghanaian, but they have some from all across the continent. Great art, great print, just some nice, nice stuff that I actually appreciate. Um, I just appreciate, um, just fashion that has a more colorful print focused lens which y'all all know um so happy that we got to see that we're gonna see it tomorrow too because we're going to the Kapinski for brunch but um we went to african regent for christmas brunch which we actually did that um in 28 in 2019 for christmas but it was the sunday brunch they had a great great choir um, that sounds like a record. I call them a gospel choir, and my husband said it's not a gospel choir. He said that's not gospel. But it's not shade, is it, Cal? No. No. It's no shade. They sound incredible. Um, and they're just great. So if you ever come to Accra, I strongly suggest that you visit the African region. They have a great brunch. It's more family-oriented. Um, a lot of people reserve space here every year for their family. Um, so it's always good to see that in the food. I like the food, it's buffet style. I actually like the food. Um, I had some jollof and some fish and some kele wele and it was great. And I had some mango for dessert and Mr. B and Kennedy had, you know, some dessert. Mr. B had some ice cream. Um, and yeah, we went to the grocery store. We went to ShopRite to get just some snacks and like some water and stuff. And now we're just gonna chill in the room and relax. It's like maybe four o'clock. My sister's flight, my sister and my niece come in at like 7.55. And so we're gonna head out at like 7.50 to go pick them up, just me and Ken. And yeah, and then we're gonna be done for the night. Okay, so. I just came from getting my sister's key and now I'm trying to get back to my room. I actually don't know how to get back. This place is so big, so I'm trying to find the elevator. Good morning, say good morning, man. Good morning. That's my niece. They have arrived. It's my sister, my daughter. Mr. B is right there. So we're just headed for brunch at the cafes. We have on the female puff sleeve top and my Valentino bag, of course. So we're just getting in and we're headed and we're headed out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mr. B.
to Kapinski and we're about to go to like a, a African concept store and then we're just gonna chill at our apartment at the beach and relax. Right now I'm just waiting for my sister who's at the ATM. doing my makeup I have some clothes out because I'm actually doing a shoot with Kofi this morning I am going to shoot like four or five looks so I can have some looks for my social media um, so far I've just been shooting like family looks because I'm you know I'm on vacation with my family I haven't really taken much for my feed but I do want to capture some content while I'm out here so I'm just doing my makeup this is like all my makeup, never mind my bottomless. Um, yeah, and also this is how I sleep in the big braids. I just have a jumbo bonnet and I just roll around like normal. So I'm doing my makeup and then I'm gonna meet Kofi. Well, Mr. B is actually downstairs getting coffee. And then I think my sister's gonna help me with my shoot so we can like cross town. Um, but we're gonna do a bunch of looks over here by my place. And then we're probably going to go to like Independence Square, Jubilee House, stuff like that. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. I am trying to do a photo shoot and it is raining outside. The photographer is being so generous and it's raining. It's like, it's really raining and I'm trying to shoot. Mm -hmm. Cause this is all the time I have to shoot really. Oh, this is my outfit from my failed photo shoot. This is my outfit from my failed photo shoot from Cold Gaia. It's so nice. I need to tie it up. But it's a nice outfit. So now I'm going back to the room. Oh. We play live from Buka in the Buka Street. Miss B. Who may name? was too son to speak. Can you say hi to the people of YouTube? Hi to the people of YouTube. Oh, Kennedy, say hi to the people of YouTube. She's me mugging Cal. Cal, say hi to the people of YouTube being funny Cal. Nay, nay, say hi to the people of YouTube. Not random. But this is where all of the African diaspora, like, clothes are like Andre Iyama yeah this is like okay we are outside of the lot which is an African diaspora concept store it has most of the luxury African designers are here so um, we're about to go in <laughs>
I am leaving my lunch um, at the Kapinski and I am going to go back to get dressed so we can head to uh, Afrochella. Okay, we are at Afrochella. The people are very excited. We see lots of vendors and food. The entrance, getting in was actually really easy, to be honest. Um, I'm actually surprised. We got in in like five minutes, whereas last time we were in general admission and it was super hot. Y'all can't hear me. It's too much going on. This is my dress, you can't even see it, and these are my shoes. Um, but I just got my makeup done, so. <laughs> rise and shine I don't know what kind of outfit this is but we are headed to Cape Coast Cape Coast <laughs> it's too early
is a slave dungeon um, here in Ghana. This is going to be our second time here. But we are at Elmina, which is a slave dungeon. Here's my niece. Um, but it is massive. It is absolutely massive. And I think it's just, I've been here a few times, but it continues to shock me. I'm like, just the gravity of it. There are certain places I can't go in anymore. Once is enough for me. And this might be it twice might be enough for me. Atlantic Ocean off the coast of Ghana, Cape Coast. It is so pretty. That's my daughter and my niece. So nice.
leaving W.E.B. Du Bois' final resting place. His wife is also buried there. And that's where he lives. There's my family. <laughs> um, and it's so nice to be here because it's actually not that many people. This is the day before, um, I guess it's New Year's Eve. Yeah, it's New Year's Eve. So we're just relaxing, chilling, really enjoying ourselves, enjoying the weather. This is also a really beautiful neighborhood and a great way to enjoy just New Year's Eve, I think, with the Pan-African mist himself. So, enjoying this. art center my makeup is just like breaking up from my shades we're in the art center um buying a bunch of art they have a bunch of other trinkets and souvenirs but we're here buying a bunch of art so we already buy a lot of art for our house anyway okay um oh this is all messed up we just had dinner at the Moven peak which is a place that we love to come to over and over again it has such a nice pool area so we're just leaving and going back to our place. Okay, so we're about to leave the Moven Peak. My sister's just at the ATM machine. It is a beautiful, beautiful breeze right now. Um, it is New Year's Eve, but it is surprisingly quiet. Um, I don't know if it has to do with COVID or what, but it's surprisingly quiet at the Moven Peak right now. 
but I am totally just enjoying the breeze, the energy. It's just so really, it's just so good right now. So I'm just enjoying a Good morning, good morning from Ghana and my dingy pajamas that I've worn into the ground. Um, today is my sister's last day and it is our last day in this apartment. We are moving over to the Kapinski um, for a week before we go home. So today is January 1st, first day of 2022. I feel so bad because I haven't really been posting on Instagram. Um, I do have some content. I just haven't been posting. Um, but I will be posting soon. And I never really feel bad about posting, not posting anywhere, except something's in my eye. I don't know, hopefully that was it. But I only feel bad about not posting on Instagram and TikTok because I feel like people come there for daily content, but I haven't updated my Pinterest. I haven't updated my YouTube, which like, I need, I know I need to get a hold of my YouTube life in 2022. I can't make promises. I cannot make promises. But um, we're headed over to the Kapinski. I need to finish and put on my outfit. It's just like a really loose outfit by um, Talensi, which is a Ghanaian brand. So love them. And we're just going to relax today. We actually have two brunches. I say we're going to relax. And then I say we have two brunches. You know the vibe. Goodbye to this beautiful place. Such good ceilings. Love this place. That was Kennedy's room in there. Steps. I love this place. This place is really nice. This place is actually, I think, for sale. Um, what's crazy, I think, is in America, we pull the plug out, but here you just like turn it off and say that you no longer want the power and energy. I'm like doing my makeup here. This is obviously messy because we are like trying to finish packing. This is the outfit that I'm wearing for today. And um, yeah, so this is the bedroom that we had. The bed was kind of small, but it worked out. Great view, beautiful view. I absolutely love this facility, Embassy Gardens. Though we couldn't take very many pictures here, but I still really liked it. It was really great. So um, that's what I appreciated about it. We have this like closet area, bathroom, great big old shower, loved it. So let me finish getting dressed. All right. Okay, all right. I don't know how to, we're gonna do it like this. Okay, so we are all packed and we just have this left, which is my St. Laurent tote bag. I have my Chanel sandals, get into the nails. These are fully done, but a few of these popped off because I was packing. I just have on a really loose set today. This is from Talensi. Get into the shoe. The shoe is from Steve Madden. So I'm pumping through in an actual shoe. Bag is Valentino. Um, this is like my vacation bag, but I need to put my nails on. I need to put some nails on. Cause I'm just riding around here dirty and um, I need to put some nails on. So that's what I'm about to do. And then we're just waiting on um, Abna, who was going to check us out. Um, I actually wonder if this is the, no. She's gonna check us out of the hotel. Both rooms, mine, ours and my sister's are in my name, so I have to be here to check out for both of them. But my sister just took her PCR test. Um, a doctor came over, and so that's exciting. Um, that, you know, she didn't have to go to like a facility, which I feel like puts you at risk. Uh-oh, there's my sister. Yes! Me and my sister, we're just in the lobby waiting on Mr. B, waiting on Mr. B. He needs to come down and get my bag. Um, 
Then we're gonna go upstairs for brunch. Oh, there he goes. Oh, there he is on that side. Okay. There's Mr. B. Mr. B. There goes Mr. B. So, um, Mr. B, my niece, and uh, Kennedy went ahead and checked in, and me and my sister stayed back to check out. And so now, look at why you don't want to get in. The people are gonna see you regardless. Now. <laughs> and so, oh wow, there's a wedding. There's a little bit of wedding. I want no, because they would be out already, or they might be in a, like a room or something. That is so pretty. I would totally have like an anniversary celebration here. I don't know if my sister would come back, but um, I would definitely try to have it. Um, Cause I love it. leaving the vine me and my sister brunch number two yes we did yes we did it was totally worth it wasn't worth it? it did we forget the box no it's in my purse oh i was like wait a minute because we brought some um truffle killer willy the truffle, truffle killer willy uh with us oh this house right here looks nice um okay now we're about to head out there is our driver 